dropped me off. Um, so I'm gonna go do a little bit of shopping. I'm looking for a pair of shoes to match my new bag. I'm gonna go to Dior, Chanel, look if they have anything nice. I'm also looking for a new card holder. So I'm actually near, right next to Selfridges. So I'm gonna go inside in a bit. Um, but yeah, I had a really pleasant journey with my Uber driver, you know, sometimes I have really pleasant journeys. Like this time, the car was amazing. The driver was lovely. He gave me um, water, gums, whatever I want. He was really lovely. Sometimes the Uber drivers could be quite rude. <laughs> I'm gonna go in now and let's see what's new. Oh, look at the window display. Charlotte Tilbury, is it? No, actually, yeah, it's Charlotte Tilbury. Look at this Hermes blanket with grey and beige. It's absolutely stunning. It's definitely on my wish list. An Hermes blanket. So gorgeous. So everyone, um, at the lift, going to the fourth floor to leave my coat so I don't carry it with me. Sorry, I'm vlogging from my phone. You can see my terrible <laughs> spot. Yeah, yeah. So you can't really see me going back downstairs to the first, actually to the ground floor to see someone from Louis Vuitton. I mentioned on my Instagram stories that I scratched the corner, so I'm not sure yet it's showing of my uh -huh. petite mal. So I want to see if they can uh -huh. do something about it. Look everyone, what is this? I think they have a pop-up. What is this big man? asked about the bag i'll switch the camera and show you i just went to that i think it was a pop-up and it turned out it's a men's collection um so yeah let me um because i'm logging from my phone now i'll switch the camera and i'll show you and i'll explain what happens with the bag all right so basically they said they have to send the bag to paris it will take about six weeks and they can replace the corners and it will be about 200 pounds but yeah, they can fix it, but they have to send it to Paris. They can't fix it here in England. So yeah. All right, so next I'll quickly pop in Chanel and see the card holders, because I need a new card holder, guys. Let me just show you the window display, because I won't be able to vlog inside. I'll go have a look at the card holders, because my YSL one looks very sad and dirty, so. Um, let's see if I can find anything nice and colourful. collection I thought the new collection is out already but it's coming in eight days so I'll be back to have a look at the card holders I didn't buy any card holders now they didn't have any bright colors ideally I'm looking for white pink like a light colored card holder but I didn't have any they only have mostly blacks and bright red so I'm on my way to the shoes now to have a look at the shoes and see if I can find something to match my new bag guys look at the little detail with the brooches how adorable all right i'm on the first floor and i'm gonna go to leave it on check out some of the bags and the new boots i think they have the new boots um i'll show you then if they have them and try them on all right let's go
This is one of the newest styles they have. It's so cute. I really like this one, but it's not for sale, it's a display only. I do like this new bag as well. What do you guys think? Which one is your favorite? These are the new boots I was telling you about. Oh my god, they're so beautiful. And they have them in a similar style. I'll show you the other ones, but I love these. These are amazing. So these two styles are my favorite. They have another one with a freely detail. They're gorgeous as well, but I think these two are my favorite. <laughs> Look at them, so beautiful, I'm obsessed. Wow. This is the lacy pair which gives me medieval vibes. <laughs> Guys, what do you think about the Louis Vuitton bucket bag? I really like it, it's so adorable. Um, they said it's sold out currently but they can find it for me if I decide to get it it's really nice i'm not sure if if it's my style if you know what i mean um because i really like my petite mal but this one is really cute and very trendy i'm just afraid that it's a bit too trendy and it will go out of style very quick but let me know what you think and also let me know what you think about the boots i really love the boots and they're surprisingly comfortable they're not too high so yeah i'm gonna go to dior next and then Chanel probably. Okay. And you only have the black and the red? With the flowers, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Do you guys recognize this mirror? It's from one of my previous vlogs I found the same mirror to quickly show you my outfit because the lighting here is perfect it's not too crowded so let me quickly show you my outfit I'm loving it by the way this shirt it's a bit creased although I ironed it uh, it's from Zara and it's one of my favorite Zara shirts I love it uh, because of this ruffle detail um, then I'm also wearing my Chanel pendant necklace um, this cardigan I showed you in one of my favorites video it's quite old now um, it's from Cos. If it's still available, I'm not sure if it is, um, but if it's available, I will link it down below. Um, my new River Island Amelie jeans in very dark grey. And my Coco boots. These are surprisingly comfortable, guys. I can walk in these. Um, my feet are not tired, although I know I came with a cab. <laughs> I took a taxi to Selfridges, but still I've been walking around Selfridges, so, so far they're good and I'm also wearing my petite mal. Look at these, these are such a gorgeous colour. They come in white as well. One of the most beautiful shoes but I can only admire them because they're too high for me. Sad. Okay, let's have a look at some Manolos. I think I'm the only person who finds these very uncomfortable. Let me know guys if you find the heels, the Manolo Blani heels comfortable, but I don't know why everyone says that they're very comfy. When I, whenever I try them on in this heel height, like this is I think not the highest, they are so uncomfortable, but I do like the flats. I actually want to try a pair of flats. These are gorgeous. I think I might try these if they have them in my size. They're so beautiful. I found my color as well, gray. Asked if they have them in 38. Hopefully, they have them. Now, try them on in grey. Mm. 
sales assistant who's helping me is very rude <laughs> but um, she walked away now so anyway um, these are the two colors that I really like um, ideally the beige as well but they don't have the beige ones but I love the gray the black ones are really nice as well what do you think do you prefer the black or the gray All right, so the girl in Manolo Planic, <laughs> I left, guys, because um, she was in a really bad mood. Maybe she was on her period or something, but she wasn't that nice, and I would never, ever purchase um, something from uh, a sales assistant who's Manolo. like serving me bad. Let me know if you're the same, but if they're not providing a good customer service, they're making me not want to purchase the item even if I really like it. I'd prefer to go and buy it from somewhere else but not from her. Anyway, the shoes are very comfortable. <laughs> um, I've never tried the flat monoplanics. They're really nice. I actually really like them so I might consider buying a pair for summer. Alright, um, I think next stop will be... I think, I'm, I think I'm going around in circles but the next stop will be Chanel. You know, I think that will be my last stop. Oh, actually no, I'll go to Dior and next to Chanel. And then, yeah. <laughs> so this is the My Lady Dior, the new size in grey. And this is the new season color. I call it the ballerina pink color. So beautiful. Oh my god, oh my god, look at the little twilly with the M. And they're showing me matching shoes. They have them in patent in this gorgeous fabric nude color. Okay, let's see. Oh my god, how good do these look together? I'm in love. Last stop will be Chanel after Dior to check if they have anything in grey for my bag. They fed me with so much chocolate in Dior. It's insane. They gave me a pack of three chocolates and when I finished them, they gave me another one. Um, they were really lovely. The service in Dior is always great, especially here in Selfridges. And I have an essay that I want to recommend. I'll leave her details down below. She's so nice, guys. Um, definitely go see her if you come shop here in um, Selfridges. So I'm gonna go grab my stuff <laughs> from the clock room and then I will leave you and I can't wait to show you what I bought as well hopefully you can hear because I'm literally shouting <laughs> I'm not sure if I can carry all the bags with me I can't wait to show you what I got I'm really happy and um, I will grab a taxi on my way home um, so yeah I'll speak to you later guys <laughs>